no more competition. So let's get into it guys. Hello everyone, my name is Al and welcome to my channel Simply Create with Al. And if you're new here, please go ahead, subscribe to my channel. I am here making manifesting easier for you, sharing all my tips and advice so that you can use them to create the life I've always dreamed of. And if you're in need of coaching, go to my description box, all information is there. But right now, let's get into today's topic. Sometimes we do make our lives quite complicated, don't we? And Often it's because we haven't understood one very important thing. We create what we focus on, okay? So we see something suspect or we see something that we do not like in any kind of our relationships, at work, at home, without a specific person or with our parents, any kind of relationship. And then we focus on it. And we create assumptions that often aren't what we really want. They are absolutely not what we want to see in our reality. But yet, we focus on it. And then, when we get the answer we have been looking for outside, that there is in fact a third person, there is in fact some kind of competition in your life, then we get mad at other people. And I'm not saying that they don't have played any part in this. What I'm saying is we communicate with the source within us, awareness, God, the universe, with our focus. And whatever we focus on, we create. And because there is no block there, because you are actually looking for it, expecting it. It happens, it is created and quite easily. So maybe you put someone on a pedestal. You say, oh, you are too good for me. You are amazing, you know, I'm blessed to be in your life. And then you wonder, how did I create that? And if you have created a third party, there is no time to blame yourself for this. There is no reason. Now you know the answer. And when you know the answer, you have power because you can change it. I know it's easier said than done. But the way you change that is you shift your focus. You can use it before you create that third party. You know, pay attention to your assumptions. Pay attention to what perspective you are choosing in your life. Create things that are in accordance to what you want and completely ignore what you don't. But if that third party is there, and again, it doesn't matter if it's at work or in your relationship or with friends, the principle is the same. What you're going to do is go back to yourself. Tell yourself that you are enough, that you are good enough to be chosen, that you are good enough to have what you want, that you are good enough that people recognize that in you. Tell yourself that. They are not the star of your life. You should be, right? The star of your movie. So own that place in your life. And try to look at yourself the way you look at that person that you are putting on a pedestal. You are not blessed to be in their lives, but they are blessed to be in your life. You have a lot to give. And you are an amazing person. I don't even know you, but I'm sure you are. So start seeing yourself as that amazing person that you are. That has qualities that only you have. That has the heart that only you have. Has the mind that only you do. Don't reduce yourself to superficial things. 
Don't create a competition out of everything. Don't look at yourself and tell yourself in the mirror, but there are people that are taller, there are people that are thinner, there are people that are more pretty, there are people that are more that. Yeah. And there will always be, but it's not a competition because there is only one you with everything that you have to offer, everything that you have to give, with the smile that you have, with the love that you have to give, with the happiness that you have shared in your life, with everything. And that makes you worthy. Your beauty is just a part of it. And there are so many more things there. So, there is no competition for you. And the moment that you recognize that uniqueness in yourself, people are going to look at you and recognize that too. Okay? See your beauty. Your beauty that is inside and out. Okay? And own it. And don't be afraid. Be who you are. Accept who you are. And people are going to accept you. People are going to recognize your value too. And everything starts with you. Well, guys, that's it from me. I hope you liked this video. If you did, give me a like, subscribe to my channel. And we're going to talk soon. Bye, guys.